today in Anna's nursery. Say hello. Uh. We had a great weekend. My parents came up for Mother's Day and we hung out and went on a walk and um, got to spend some time with them. Probably seems crazy to most of you, but Anna actually used the potty for the first time on Mother's Day, which I think is a fabulous Mother's Day gift. Um, so we're not like officially potty training her, but we're just giving her the chance to do that whenever she wakes up and she likes it so far. Um, in addition to that, Dan got me a new camera for Mother's Day. Um, so far all these videos have been filmed on my cell phone, which I'm pretty proud of what I've been able to do with the cell phone. Um, the cameras are very expensive, but he found a really... He found a really great deal on a camera, and so it should be coming in the mail today. So, we are just hanging out here this morning. Just the two girls and the pup. Are you helping me work on my quilt? Um, I meant to be cutting out denim squares. And we have a little crafty girl on our hands. Anything new she has to check out. Ooh, that's nice. It's like a scarf. Gotta treat yourself. So for Mother's Day, I bought Kaylin a Canon G7X, which is a camera she's always wanted. Um, make it much more easy to do uh, her vlogging that she so enjoys. So, uh, I received it, obviously today is not Mother's Day, sadly, so I explained to her that she was going to get it, um, but uh, now I get to go deliver it to her. It looks like this. It's pretty cool. Uh, anyway, so we're driving home to go deliver it. Did you just go pee pee? <laughs> this little girl just went on her potty. So that's uh, two diapers today that we saved, which is more than I can hope for. As much as I like living in the country, these are the moments when I wish we had sidewalks. Um, one of my packages has been delivered, and so I think the camera might also be with it, but I have to put Anna in the car seat to go get the mail. It's like a quarter of a mile, which doesn't sound like a long way, but do what you gotta do. Mail is here. Not the camera. There she is. Come here. Maybe. Come here. Maybe. We've been waiting all day for that. 
I had it. <laughs> I didn't want it to get delivered here if it was able to come in before Sunday. Got it. <laughs> it's so pretty, I want to play. Yep. Yeah. I want to hold her. I didn't see you at all yesterday. Not even a little bit. Okay, a little side by side. This is the cell phone over here. Hello. And over here is the new camera. And over there is the grumpy baby who dropped her water bottle. <laughs> so, you guys will have to tell me about the quality difference. We'll do side by side. Hello. Morning guys, getting ready for the day while Anna takes her nap. I'm listening to a sermon today from, please focus, please focus, from Doxa Church um, in their series of The Unexpected Cross and it has been great. Sometimes it's nice just to start off the day with some words of encouragement, um, a lesson to learn, and it just puts me in a good mood for the whole rest of the day. Hey! We're going to this store. Oh my gosh, mom life. Child, I just bought you new shoes and you lost one already. There you are, in the kitchen. So here's our little Costco haul. It says a lot about our family. Um, coffee, formula, jelly beans and ketchup. And then I found a couple summer dresses for only $10 because I like to stay a little more covered up during the summer. Are you ready to go home and have lunch? Okay. <laughs>
What's better than your favorite blankie right out of the dress? You know guys, Anna is almost a year and she didn't have a cell phone yet. Which is kind of just offensive. So we went out. Oh, hi. Got her a Blackberry. It's Nana. Talk to Nana. I think that Blackberries were made for babies because they're the only ones with fingers small enough to hit the buttons. Remember? Remember when phones had buttons? Morning guys, here at the park today with little Miss Anna. Very ladylike. I learned this awesome new trick for putting the laundry away really fast. Ready? One, two, three. Ta-da! Piece of cake.
a little bit of a power struggle this morning. And daddy left us alone. Yeah. Do you want some breakfast? Would that help? Do you need some breakfast? Banana? Okay, we'll have banana. No need to blow dry. You live in Terrace Heights, apparently. How's your banana? Is it working out? Is it good? Um, Dan went for a service project with our church today. I'm hoping it goes well because of the wind. They're supposed to be like picking up trash and doing yard work, but I don't know how it's gonna go when it's this windy outside, so I'm hoping it doesn't rain and that they're able to get some of their stuff done. And that means for now it's just Anna and myself. The wind stopped. Yeah, it did. It like all of a sudden just chilled out completely. I got you a gift. <gasps> Ooh! Love. That is true love. <laughs> 